It's a quandary that's perplexing. Let's agree to disagree. No, let's agree that you agree with me. I actually come across quite a few atheists who say, I used to be a Christian. I want to challenge that right away. You can't say, I used to be a Christian. To say, I used to be a Christian, assumes that God does exist. You could instead say, I used to be delusional. That would be consistent with what your worldview is now saying. But you cannot say, I used to be a Christian. It would be like me saying, you know, I had a wonderful marriage that lasted for 13 years. My wife and I even had three absolutely beautiful children. <sighs> Until I found out that my wife wasn't real. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. You cannot say, I used to be a Christian. By the way, the Bible is very clear about this, Bernie. Those that left us were never among us. So it's impossible to claim that I used to be a Christian. Um, I, I did have a question when it, when it kind of comes to this, because Bernie brought it up again. I said, look, I used to have a relationship with Christ. I used to be a Christian. As a Christian, did you have a relationship with Jesus Christ? I thought I did. Did you have a relationship with Jesus Christ? Yes or no? I thought I did at the time, just okay. like you do. Yeah. So if you now say you thought you did, mm -hmm. but you didn't, mm -hmm. were you ever a Christian? Because as a Christian, it's all about having a relationship with Christ. So if you say, I thought I did, but I didn't, then let's, like I said, you never were a Christian. I have all the feelings. I, was, I feel like I was led by God. Uh, man, drug addicts have feelings. I don't care about feelings. I felt like I was led by God. I felt like God gave me answers. Feelings don't matter. Brain. What I'm talking about is true. Did you have a relationship with Jesus Christ? At the time, I thought I did. Okay. Did you or not? Yes or no? Well, it's kind of like an American Indian. You know, they might have a relationship with a tree or rock because they think there's spirits in there, but there's no spirits in there. But... Oh, so you weren't really a Christian. Because Christianity is having a relationship with Jesus Christ. If you now deny that you had that relationship, you're denying that you ever were a Christian, which is a, my whole I was point. just as much a Christian then as you are now. No, I, now, when I was 21, you could have said the exact same thing. But at the age of 23, Jesus Christ took out my heart of stone and gave me heart of flesh, granted me repentance, and I have a personal relationship with Jesus Christ. I said the same did thing. You, did you ever have a personal relationship? Yes. You did now. Yes, I preached it. So yeah. you did have a personal relationship with Jesus Christ? I thought I did. <laughs> That's the problem. Right, we'll take more questions from the audience. For... Ladies and gentlemen, to deny the existence of God is to be reduced literally to foolishness is what it's uh, going to be reduced to. Mr. Bernie here has claimed that, um, that he knew all about God. He had these feelings. Knowledge does not equal a relationship. I can I could read the biographies of the president. I could learn. I could follow every speech he's had. I could know lots of stuff about the president. That doesn't mean I have a relationship with him. Bernie, as we already showed, never was a Christian. If he was, then I have to ask that question again. Did you have a relationship with Jesus Christ? That is by very definition. Christianity. Christianity is not about a religion. It's about having a personal relationship with a Savior, Jesus Christ. If you, and you're, he's having a hard time answering it, kind of like, well, I don't know. Because to say, yes, he did, means God exists. To say, no, he didn't, means he wasn't a Christian. That question undermines the whole philosophy, the whole thought process of, I used to be a Christian. Okay, let's say Eric, you're right, I give up. Woo!